Now let's start once and for all. Now the first thing is to get a bootstrap, second thing is to get our jQuery. The third thing is to extract the bootstrap file and to open our text editor, link the files downloaded and let's continue coding. Now I'm going to open my uh, Google Chrome. Now as at the time this tutorial is being designed, I used uh, bootstrap or sorry bootstrap or 3.6 so let's go here. So click on this button here. Download Bootstrap. Now, as you're waiting for that to download, you can just open your now jQuery.com. <laughs> now you can click on this button here. So click on this. Now I think both are downloaded. Now let's click on this showing folder cut. Now create the folder on your desktop. Uh, let's see uh, tutorial. Best the first one. Go back to your, your browser, fetch the already downloaded uh, Java, uh, jQuery file too. Now, the folder, paste it here as well. Now, extract this bootstrap here. Now, bootstrap file, you just need to go for these, copy the JS and the CS folder, paste it here. Now I can delete this and this. Now when that is done, rename this to jQuery alone and move it inside the JS folder. Now once you've done this, the next thing is to open our text editor. I'm using Notepad plus plus. Or I can make use of my uh, sublime text if I want. Now just need to like uh, you know sorry for save now you look at the file called tutorial now you name it uh, let's say index now the text editor sees it as an HTML file. Now we break, break this down. Now the next thing is to write the head tag. Now the next thing is to write it, sorry the title tag. Sorry. Now the title tag can say. Login page. I can man that her tutorial. Now, next thing is for us to link our files we downloaded. Now, what you need to do is already, you know, let's clear this. We don't need this. href that means uh, where it can be found. Bootstrap. Please. Be very careful with uh, the way you type uh, something. The next one is script. Now, we don't need this. Just only need the script source. Sir? Uh, is a JS bootstrap that's JS close it script
sir. Now the next one is a script sus. Close it too. So JS slash uh, J query dot Okay. Now once that is done after this, just open your, uh, let's see, uh, just to test if your pages are properly linked, what you need to do is just to, you know, to open a div. Now you can assign the class to this div. You can make it jumbo troll. Now you can check your documentation for this. Now you can insert h1 tag you see you are welcome now let's go straight to our folder and check now bootstrap files are be our best viewed with uh, google chrome so you, can, you check it out now good now with what you have on the screen here now you can see how it works now i'll meet you in the next video kindly stay put thank you